Good morning. Good morning. I'm still on back to school, and because some people started this week and some people started last week, it's that time of the year all the way around the world. Children have either already started back to school or they will very soon. I can tell you one thing that is very important for a teacher is to find out what their students already know. That way they will know where they should start in teaching them what they need to learn. I'm going to share with you a few things that um, happened in different classrooms this year at the beginning of the school. The teacher says, how old is your father? The student says, he is six years old. The teacher said, what? How is this possible? And the student says, well, he only became a father when I was born. <laughs> the teacher says, Maria, go to the map and find North America. Maria said, here it is. Correct. Now, class, who discovered America? Maria, the class, <laughs> the class responds. Glenn, how do you spell crocodile? K-R-O-K-O-D-I-A-L. That is incorrect. He said, maybe it's wrong, but you asked me how I would spell <laughs> Donna, what is the chemical formula for water? H-I-J-K-L-M-N-O. The teacher said, what are you talking about? He said, well, yesterday you said it was H2O. <laughs> One more. Teacher. Clyde, your composition on my dog is exactly the same as your brother's. Did you copy his? No, sir. It's the same dog. <laughs> <laughs> Wouldn't it be nice if we could all have the innocence and the simplicity in thought sometimes as a child? Mark 10, 14 says, Let the little children come to me and do not hinder them for the kingdom of God belongs to such as these. According to the Bible, we're going to have a little math lesson. Can one plus one ever equal three? Children. <laughs> yes, it can. Well, how can that be, you might ask? The answer is simple. In Matthew chapter 18, Verse 20, it says, For where two or three come together in my name, there am I with them. If, you, if two are gathered in Jesus' name, then Jesus is there with them. So one plus one can equal three. I'm not sure exactly how many people are here this morning, but whatever the number is, you can add one to it because Jesus is here too. 